and welcome back to Catharsis Inc. So today I'll be doing the haul that you chose on my poll the other day. So if you didn't see it, it was actually on my community tab. So if you go to the main um, page of my YouTube channel, there'll be a little bar up top that gives you different tabs. And one of those tabs says community. Click on that and you'll be able to see the poll and any posts that I do. But the poll was which video would you like to see next? And I gave the options of thrift store haul, Halloween haul, Dollar Tree haul, or it doesn't matter. And as of right now, the winner is the thrift store haul. So that's what I'll be doing today. And let me tell you, I found some really unique pieces. Absolutely love them. So without further ado, let's go ahead and hop into the haul. So the first piece is this gorgeous picture. And if there's too much of a glare, I'll do some B-roll here of the picture because I really want you to see it. And this was $14.99 and well worth it. The frame is absolutely beautiful. And I love the artwork. This is going to look beautiful on my gallery wall in my bedroom. So I picked that up. And then wait till you see these next pictures. I about died. They are perfect for my aesthetic. They're really big. So I'll probably have to do some B-roll over these as well. But look at this. <gasps> have you ever in all your life? These are gorgeous. So this one has an ink and quill on it with some books. So beautiful. And this was originally from Kirkland's for $24.99. And I'm trying to see how much was this? These were $7.99. So it's a set of two. So let me go ahead and show you the second one here. So it's a matching set, but they have different pictures, of course. So then we have this one with the envelopes and the quill pen, pen with some books. Oh my goodness. Love it. So originally $24.99 and I got them for $7.99 each. So beautiful, absolutely love them. I cannot believe I, I got so lucky and found them. Holy cow. Then next up, I found a brand new box of oil lamps. So it comes with two lamps and then some oil. And it looks like originally, right here it says, ten dollars i got it at a discount for eight dollars so i saved two dollars not sure how old these are heck i think even if you go to walmart they're more expensive than that so i think i still made out pretty well super excited i found these so the next few items are from an antique mall and first up is this beautiful amber perfume bottle so it's got the little stopper on there so gorgeous and i only paid four dollars for this that is a great deal next up is this miniature cloche i thought this was so pretty i can do little moss scenes with some beetles absolutely love this this one was uh 4.97 and then next up, I found this miniature amber bottle. I love the design on there. It's so pretty. Love that. And then I also found this Halloween block. I love the raven and just the font. I thought that was so pretty. And it's just a wooden block. And this one was $4.55. And, oh, I forgot to tell you, this one was only $2, this little bottle here. Great deal. And then my favorite find from this particular antique store is this. So, as you can see, it looks like a little book. And it's, it's metal. You open it up, and it's an inkwell. What? An inkwell? Like, get out of here! And it's in the shape of a book. 
like oh my gosh this is a beautiful find absolutely love this and this one was the most expensive it was $16 but well worth it love this so much and then next up are some items from a different antique store and oh my goodness wait till you see these items so this is going to be a three-piece set and i got the entire set for only 15 dollars so i got this little napkin holder and it's it's heavy duty it's this gorgeous i don't know if this is like brass or gold plated but it's so beautiful love that and then the second piece to that is this gorgeous piece and as you can see it's a little tarnished so maybe it is brass oh my gosh this is so beautiful love it and then the third piece is this kleenex box <gasps> have you ever in all your life oh my goodness so beautiful and the bottom is like a brown felt and only $15 <laughs> oh my goodness I hit the jackpot seriously holy cow couldn't have got a better deal on that then next up I found this beautiful doily and it's rectangle shape. This is actually the first time I've seen a rectangular one. Normally they are always circle, but I thought this was gorgeous. I got this for $5. And then I also found this Sears Roebuck Company catalog from 1897 and I got this for $10. I was super excited about this. It's hardcover and the pages are absolutely gorgeous look at these so gorgeous so i thought about using these for my junk journal i don't know i'll be i'm i don't really like tearing up books especially vintage ones because i love i love books especially old ones but I don't know I just think the pages would be beautiful in a junk journal and of course I would be reusing them putting them to good use so maybe I'll go I'll just go ahead and do that and then next up I got some pictures I love finding old pictures and all of these were under three dollars so I got this little one here she was only a dollar thought she was really cute i got this one which was three dollars hopefully she's coming up on camera i don't know if you can see her or not then i got this one for a dollar fifty and then this beautiful lady for a dollar Then I got this cute little one for a dollar. And then this one is a little card. So it folds up and this was $2. And it's a card to a student from a teacher. I just really liked the saying on the outside. So I'll be using them to junk journal as well. Next up are some more items from a thrift store so i found these really cute it's like a grass type material they're bunnies i thought these would be perfect for austera they were a dollar 99 each and i found three of them thought they were really cute and then i also found this item it's called a candle pin I'm not sure what that is but I thought it was gorgeous and I thought it would look beautiful on the front cover of a journal so I picked that up this was only 99 cents and I thought you could even replace the picture here with like an old-timey picture I thought that would be really pretty and then I also found these bags they're called thanksgiving leftover bags so you can put the person's name here and these were 99 cents 
so they have three count in here i thought those were really cute would be perfect for thanksgiving then i found this adorable teacup with the ink and quill and the candle and then i also picked up some patterns that I found so these are like little um, shawls or cardigans and then I also found this one for like a tunic I guess that would be what you would call it and then oh I got two of those teacups and the teacups were 99 cents each and then the patterns were only 25 cents so that was a really good deal and then i also found the complete works of william shakespeare this was four dollars and the year that it was published let's see if i can find it this was printed in the usa in 1853 so I thought that was a really good deal for that. So pretty. And then the last two items I found on Facebook Marketplace. And they are this gorgeous lampshade with these little beaded tassels on it. I thought these were gorgeous. And as I was looking for lampshades, I noticed that they are really expensive. So I got a great deal. I got two of these for $15 each. I thought that was an awesome deal so I picked these up super excited I'm actually gonna be having a video come out probably in the next couple weeks about new lighting that I've done in the witch's cottage so stay tuned for that but I hope you all enjoyed this haul if you did definitely give it a like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one thanks guys bye